well literature is all about stories and stories and i know you all love to read stories but writing one may appear a difficult task to some of you so today i shivani batra from hansraj public school panchkula am going to make this task easy for you so today let us learn the elements of good story writing before i just mention the elements let me tell you about the marking scheme children the title is for one mark content four marks accuracy contain 2.5 marks fluency 2.5 and remember always adhere to the word limit near about 200 to 250 words now the elements of a good story writing number 1 heading children remember heading should be related to the theme and it should be short and precise and i have noticed that many a times children do skip writing the heading thinking that at the end we will write it down but make it a habit to write the heading or the title of the story in the beginning only the next element is character children remember fewer is better don't include many characters and give the character a name without name a character doesn't seems to be appealing and a vivid description of the appearance of the character must be given the next element is the setting setting is all about the background the time the weather conditions whether day time or the night or hot or humid season and another thing it should be as brief as possible but vividly described next the plot plot should be as simple as possible and try to make it very interesting remember don't borrow any of your plot from the movies the books you have already read the stories or the shows another element is conflict try to restrict to one conflict only in order to avoid any sort of confusion in the minds of the reader next element is related to the theme theme should appeal the masses and you know the reader should feel connected to the theme and very important thing is the climax the next element climax is actually the turning point of the story and it is the most intense part of the story next is anti climax children anti climax is opposite to climax here the story starts to conclude and ending remember children that here the biggest yardstick of ending is the re resolution here central conflict is resolved it should be resolved clearly make sure the ending is quite convincing remember good should be rewarded and evil should be punished and leave a positive message at the end in order to teach you life skills the such questions related to the story writing are introduced in your 9th and 10th classes and now i hope you must have understood what an examiner expects from you while assessing your story writing thank you so much